Peace, y'all. Wanted to read this article right here. It says, Otis Blackwell, 70, wrote hit songs, Don't Be Cruel, Fever, You Give Me Fever, and many others. Nashville, Tennessee, Otis Blackwell was a prolific songwriter who wrote the signature hits, Don't Be Cruel, for Elvis Presley and Great Balls of Fire, for Jerry Lee Lewis. He died Monday of an apparent heart attack. He was 70 years old. Blackwell wrote more than a thousand songs, including Return to Cinder, All Shook Up, um, which were both recorded by Presley, Breathless, which was recorded by Lewis, and Handyman, which was recorded by James Tyler, and Fever by Peggy Lee. Ray Charles, Billy Joel, The Who, and Otis Redding were among the others who recorded his songs. I wrote Home and Prayed, Blackwell said in 1989. It makes me feel wonderful for other people to do my songs and have them sing and still be around and have people still wanting to, do, to even sing them. He was credited with writing songs that sold more than 185 million copies. Blackwell was born in New York City and he grew up wanting to be a singer. As a young man, he worked as a for a penny a day as a floor sweeper at a Brooklyn theater and later as a clothes presser. While recording songs for a small company in New York, he was asked to write songs as well. Blackwell often sang the songs himself before they were recorded, and some music historians believe his style influenced Elvis Presley, who died in 1977. I don't know except that we both sound alike, Blackwell said. I used to do quite a few demos of songs that I didn't write, songs that were his style. I w it was easy to write for him. When I would do these things, I would figure this to me singing, and this is the way he would sing them. So it came real easy. Blackwell never met Presley and said in 1989 that his relationship with the singer was best kept at a distance. We had just a great thing going. I just wanted to leave it alone. I just wanted to keep writing and let him do the singing. The funeral arrangements are incomplete. And when they're not complete, that means there's not enough money. But this brother sold 185 million songs. So we already know that he died broke. So make sure that you put on your altar Otis Blackwell. Prolific artist.